There's this place with fantastic food, but it's kind of a challenge. They do have photos of most dishes with some English text next to them, but the place doesn't have any English name, and the Chinese name is only ever shown with Chinese signs. So good luck with writing it down or checking in with Swarm or Facebook. The owner herself is there on most days, so we decided to ask her if she could speak out the name for us. This didn't necessarily make it easier for us. So now we have the challenge to find the food which is on this card um, on this thing here, which is completely in Chinese. So you go and um, check the signs, look for a very special one, okay, trim. You look on the card and here it is, and you just do. Now this is a great time to reflect upon your vocabulary or you could get some of the nice free tea. Everything apart from the food is, is self-service. So you get your own plates. Most importantly, you get to make your own dips. So you grab a flat bowl there are plenty of sauces to start off with as a base, so I'm, I'm taking soy sauce as a base. You can add chili oil, which makes it much more spicy and interesting, I love that. And just in case that chili oil isn't spicy enough, I'm adding some extra chili. And there's brown sugar here too, because apparently Taiwanese like their main courses to be slightly sweet. That's not quite my thing, so no sugar for me then. This is mapo tofu. It's silky smooth tofu in a minced meat and chili oil sauce, which will bring a whole world to your taste buds and make them tingle a lot. Ah, a classic has arrived. This is minced meat with beans, which is very tasty, but the real hidden champion here is this beef casserole enchilada. Well, it's difficult to say, but it's wonderful with sesame on top. You dip it and you will order it again every time. And then you have this pork with beans. So you've got green beans. Mm, but they are mixed with some shredded pork and garlic bits. Yeah. And this is crunchy, juicy, garlicky, meaty, quite mouth watering. Mm, wonderful combination. So I need a bit difficult to eat with chopsticks, but otherwise quite fine with that. This is also an amazing dish, one of our favorites. This is cod. It's super soft and juicy and it is, let's say, waterboarded in peanuts, in ground peanut bits with spring onion and lots of juicy. Fantastic. Obviously, no meal will be complete without some dumplings. There are all kinds of dumplings with shrimps, with beef, but I went for the classic here, pork and leek and they are juicy, cooked to perfection and they're also something that is quite edible for the little ones in the family. This sizzling pot of beef with glass noodles and lots of chili is also one of my favorites. Just remember that you don't really have to eat all of the chilies. So this is the Maidan, the bill. And for two and a half people, six dishes, we've paid 830 New Taiwan dollars, which would be something like 25 euros. So this is by far my favorite place here in Taipei. Especially because there's a nice variety of food. 
and it's super tasty. They have lots of my favourites, but they also have some very interesting other dishes. One of my favourites is the beef casserole. Oh, sorry. Can you all come on, go for it. Um, but they also have some wonderful marble tofu. And what I also enjoy a lot is, oh damn, I've just lost it in the sauce. I also enjoy a lot are the dumplings and there's some very nice beef dishes going on here. Look, there's no English name to the place. Last time we got the owner to uh, speak it out, the name of the place, and we've been practicing a tiny bit, so we're trying to surprise her after we've eaten. And she recognized us. Hey, you're the guys with the photo. So, uh, yeah. The boss runs around herself here and she seems to have one second branch of this place. So, I hope she's successful. It's great here. I don't marry many foreigners here either. Next dish. Okay. And this is pod. Big bits of fish layered with a crunchy. Is it peanuts? Is it beans? Soy crunchy things. It's fantastic. Mm. And as I said, the beef casserole, which is this here. Very good. Very good. Yay! Very good. Okay. 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 Yeah. Oh yes, that worked. Very good. That was the big moment. Now we start packing our things. And I got it right. So there you have it. This place is called Fu Rong Shan Xi Dao Xiao Mian. And it's not that difficult. Just a few steps down the road is the perfect bar to get that fish to swim. Of course, the place doesn't have an English name either, but beer is beer, right? And cocktails are cocktails. Here you can sit back, relax, and watch the nightlife unfold with all the bars, restaurants, and even shops that are open at this time of the evening. And if you didn't quite find what you wanted to eat, how about some fried rice on your knickers? <laughs>